We are going to Target. Oh, 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 oh. To buy some hair products. Which hair product we should buy today? I don't know. We should look online to see. I want to test out some dry shampoos maybe. And then um, I need a hairspray. And then we don't need any serums because I could make that. Maybe dry shampoo, some hair waxes. Okay. We'll see you in Target. Oh, okay. Nothing. Maybe. Baby, can you tell me what why I saw like that? No. He teaches me how to make American horny sound. Yes. So he teaches me like, oh, oh, daddy, and he say, yes. baby, can you just stop it? Yes. And baby, what should I say instead of daddy? And he say, nothing. Yes. So I keep saying, oh, oh, nothing. Why? Why oh man? Good job. We went to Target, but we didn't vlog in there. Yeah. We're so mile. bad, baby. We're so bad. Well, it was a little bit scary to vlog in a public setting because, like, I don't want to be preoccupied and people bump into me. Because actually, Target was very busy today. Yeah. Yeah. But the good thing, I think I saw everyone was wearing a mask. Yeah. Except, everyone. Except the people in the parking lot. But I was looking at a few things because uh, actually I'm helping out with a photo shoot on Monday, so I had to pick up some stuff. So uh, first we needed hair wax, but I didn't really know. Okay, guys, I I I don't really buy drugstore products. Um, I haven't bought them in like over a decade, uh, except for like Gatsby and maybe some other like Japanese products when I'm traveling. But I didn't know what hair wax to get because back in the day. I would use like Schwarzkopf, uh, but then their Schwarzkopf selection was very poor at this Target. So we were looking at Axe and Old Spice, but we ended up using Old Spice? Is that what we got? I don't know, maybe. The lead bottle. Yeah, the Old Spice one, because the Axe smelled really strong and artificial, and he said the Old Spice smelled a little bit more natural and subtle. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but um, basically we were looking for something really, really high hold, but not too much shine. But, 1, feet, turn left at Emerson Avenue. but yeah, I don't think I don't think American hair waxes are, are good. I think the Asian ones are a lot better. But it's fine. And then um, I was looking for a working spray, which is what you use to provide left at provide a Avenue, little bit of hold. Left. Provide a little bit of hold while you're um, styling, uh, but it's still brushable. That's a little bit harder because I feel like that's a very professional type of product to have because usually the drugstore stuff, the, the working sprays that I've tried, isn't so good uh, because it, it's a little bit tacky. Uh, usually a good working spray you want it to spray and be brushable and you can flat iron or curl over it and it's perfectly fine. It also doubles up as a heat protectant. But um, I don't know what I got today. Maybe Pantene or something? I don't know because the stuff that seemed good was quite expensive is like on professional pricing like 15 20 dollars i was trying to keep it like five or ten dollars and then a shine spray um i was looking at different shine sprays uh and shine sprays and conditioning sprays their formulation is very very similar sometimes the conditioning sprays are have a little tiny bit of water or humectant content in it but what i was looking basically is to see a hair formula that's high volatile silicone to create a lot of shine that I could kind of brush out and have it not be greasy. If you look some of it, it looks like it's all supposed to be the same, but some doesn't have volatile uh, things, so you could overdo it a lot. So yeah. Anyways, that's it for today's haul. You, you say bye to them? Bye.